What's up, everyone? We're back near the end of the season. We simulated a couple weeks here, almost about a month, actually. And a lot of stuff's happened. So we have some lingering injuries to deal with. You'll see on the right-hand side, uh, Brian Reynolds is unknown. He's battling a quad strain, so is Whit Merrifield. So that's, you know, two to three weeks from Merrifield, unknown for Brian Reynolds. They've been hurt. They're still playing. They're battling, you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, we're coming up on the stretch run. We have seven games left. Uh, it doesn't look like Brendan McKay is going to hit the, um, going to hit the 300 strikeout mark. I don't think he has enough games left, um, to make that, but he's going to come pretty dang close across 211 innings, which is crazy. But, um, Chris Archer came off the DL and his career's over. Um, he has like a half star rating. Tried to waive him, wouldn't get demoted, so we have to eat the contract. We had to release him, so we have to eat $19 million a year for the next four years, which is a disaster. Um, but anyways, let's get to the real news. We're 84 and 71, and we have a chance today, if you go to the pennant chase, our magic number, if you see folks, is 1. A 100% chance... Uh, out of the park baseball is giving us to make the playoffs. And I wanted to pause today because we have seven games left. Three are at home, two is on the road. Or three's on the three I can't do math. Three at home, four on, four on the road. But I wanted to play this game today because we could mwah, chef's kiss. Mwah, 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 mwah. We could clinch the division for the third time in four years and two years in a row when we when we beat the Cardinals today. Mm, just love that. Just love that. So we're going to come in here banged up. We're going to come in here shorthanded. But you know what? Dustin May is going to come and throw a heck of a game. We're going to get this dub. Um, so, yeah, like I said, coming shorthanded. We have some guys on fire. Hayes is cold. We have Reynolds and Merrifield are hurt. But we're going to get the win. We're going to clinch the... NL Central against our hated foes, the Cardinals. At least that's what I'm, that's what I'm hoping. I shouldn't say it like it's a certainty. But, all right, Cole Tucker's going to lead off. Uh, we've won most of the series in the back half of the of the year, too. There's The Padres were, the, I think, the only team to really beat us in a series um, since the last time we played. Everyone else, we've won like two or, th two or three or three or four of, or at least split. So, ooh, Tucker gets hit. Um, all right, Reynolds, let's go take a walk. Nope. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I feel confident about this team in the playoffs, too. I know it's just an 80-win team. Again, I'd like to win 90 games with this Pirates team eventually. Um, but doesn't look like it's going to be the case this year. Oh, I thought that might have carried there. It looked like it was kept going and going. All right, all right. But, uh, yeah, I mean, the Dodgers, they I think they came back down to earth a little bit. I don't know about the, the run differential, um, but... In terms of winning, they're not going to challenge the Mariners' record or anything like that. Or the Met, I think it was the Mets was the other team that did that. They're not going to challenge either of those records. Um, but speaking of, it's all right. We'll let them take a solo shot. It's fine. It's fine. Um, but the Cardinals, I think, are have a negative run differential. They really came back down to earth there. I think we're the only team in our division with a positive run differential. So that's what happened when our, when your uh, pitching is great. Um, Jared Kelly has got some time in the pros. He looked decent in our Sims, and we'll go through this, you know, before the playoffs. But um, yeah, uh, De La G uh, Cruz or Gar, I can't remember his name. Gars, I think it is. He got some time too. He, I don't know. Actually, he was on the roster. I don't know if he actually pitched though. Um, Coor got brought up I, again. I don't know how he did. I have to check that out too. But um, yeah, a lot of wins in the sim there. 
We're getting on base here. We're getting on base. I feel we're gonna we're gonna come through. We're gonna come through in this game. I can feel it. Yeah. Take that, Musakas. Hope that hurt. Swing and a miss, Sosa. De Young, take a seat, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Dustin May. Ooh, walk. All right, May, helping yourself out with a leadoff walk. Cole Tucker. Nah. That's the worst when the pitcher gets on and the guy behind him gets out because it's like you just you didn't do anything you just you got to take advantage when the pitcher gets on base Reynolds uh, I'm thinking about maybe bringing Martin in and then key uh, key boom in for uh Merrifield just to give him a day I mean they were on the DL and everything so did precautionary we did as a precautionary measure put him on the DL, but they're still battling it. So, I mean, when you're dealing with strains like that, there's you just gotta let it. You just gotta fight through it, you know, and just try not to do anything that makes it too much, too much worse. Dylan Carlson didn't even know run yet. He did. Uh, not this time, bub. Nice job, May. All right, Tristan Gray, three one count. Take a walk. Just walk on down to first base. Or hit it right to the shortstop. Kepler. Swing and a miss. Merrifield. Ooh, Velez. Four balls in a row. Yikes. Oh, guys, I didn't tell you, too. Uh, last video I just found out was our 50th video. Um, I'm having a blast making these. I hope you guys are enjoying watching them. If there's anything you'd like me to do differently in them, please let me know. I'm more than happy to uh, to take advice or feedback or anything along those lines. Um, but, yeah, I'm having a blast. 50 episodes, crazy. Um, I don't know if anyone wanted 50 episodes. I don't know if you guys wanted 50 episodes, especially the Pirates. But I'm just going to give it to you and hope you like it, you know? Um, I was wondering when I'm going to end the Pirates one. I was thinking of when we win the World Series is when I'll end it. But, you know, how many how many seasons can someone watch the Pirates? I mean, I could watch it all day, but someone who's not a fan, I mean, how many, how many times can they watch it? And, uh, yep, the Cardinals are trying to break this one open here. But we got the pitcher that will strike out. Yep. And then Lane Thomas. All right, so only two runs. Still within distance, but um, again, only getting one hit here. Who do they have? Sandy Koufax on the mound or something? Or, or you know, what? Or, or I shouldn't say that he was lefty. Um, you got Roger Clemens out there? Or, you know, wh why, is no one hitting, why is no one hitting this guy? Thank you, Hayes. Thank you. Swing and a miss. Little dribbler. Get that shit out of here. Oh, okay. Sure. Unbelievable. Can we make a play out there? Somebody? Someone will win this game? I guess our team doesn't hate the, the, the Cardinals like I hate the Cardinals. I guess I'm the only one. Oh, here we go. Well, it looks like we're going to have to wait a day to clinch the Central unless the Brewers lose, and then they'll just do it for us. It'll be the most anticlimactic way to clinch the division in the history of man. I 
like to come back and see if we can win it earn it ourselves. Tucker, get down. Okay, there we go. Lead off single, that's good. Reynolds, full count, walk. Nope, he's going to do something better. He's going to double into the gap. He could be a triple. Ball's very deep. Yeah, we're, we're sending him. There you go. Scoring from first. Five to one. Let's go. Tristan Gray, make it even more interesting. Oh, he will. He will. Okay, first and third, no outs. Here's where we get going. Kepler, walk. He didn't go. Yeah, there we go. Base is juiced. Let's go. Merrifield up to the dish. Two strikes. Be rare strikeout if he does. Ooh, rare. Very rare. Kendall, anything but a double play, brother. Yoke it. Yeah, okay. We're going to tag here? Nope. Who we got next? Amaya? Amaya. Don't strike out. God dang it. Thought we had something going there. Watch what a home run erase that run we just scored. Because it's the Cardinal. The Cardinal's way. The Cardinal's algorithm, I should say. Watch them. They'll find a way to erase the run we just scored in this inning. Just watch. No, they didn't. Okay, nice. Chipping away. Dustin May. Is he going to have enough juice to get through the red? You know what? We have enough arms in the bullpen here. Let's see. We've got a ready pitcher. Oh, crap. I think I just uh, accidentally hit the space bar, but oh well. So we're going to come up with uh, – I'm going to pitch with Jared Kelly. I'm going to bring the, the toy out for a spin. See how he does. See how the rookie does when he gets a chance. Cole Tucker taking a walk. Brian Reynolds. Mm. Not a lot of contact. Yeah, I got to get healthier players in the lineup here. Jared Kelly. All right, there's one out. There's two outs. I'd like to see a strikeout here, though. There we go. Home run. All right. Hey, you learned the hard way. Uh-oh. Getting a little beat up here, Rook. Let's get him get out of the setting. Let him get out of the setting. All right. There we go. All right. Jared Kelly gets out of an inning. I haven't pitched two, actually. There you go. Get down. There you go, Tristan Gray. Man, he's turned into an absolute stud this year. Probably should have pinched it for Kepler there. Oh, we're just trying to get out of this game, to be honest. Forgot about the algorithm, the Cardinal algorithm. No chance we win, so...
So the the so this is what this tells me here. The, the soft contact is good for Kelly. So he's our number four pro. He's our number two prospect, number four prospect in all baseball. Here's what this tells me: a lot of soft contact means that he has the right stuff. The lack of strikeouts right now at this stage is not concerning because he will develop that. His pitches will get better, and that will come. But the soft contact is something you necessarily can't teach and just comes with. So, like I said, I'm I'm pr I'm encouraged just by this in this uh, now again super small sample size. I understand, but other than that home run, he's limited the contact uh, pretty well. So we're down to our last out here. Jared Kelly. Yep, we're gonna let you hit. Game over. Okay. So forget about it. I wonder if we'll clinch <laughs> if Milwaukee loses. Okay, so I guess not. So we have, so now we are, we're playing Milwaukee. Magic number still one. Cardinals have a 0.1% chance of making the playoffs. Yeah, screw you. Um, so should we just sim it or should we play? What should, what should we do here? We'll play it. And if not, and if we don't get it here, we'll sim the rest. But uh, I do want to actually. Um, I want to give our guys a little bit of a rest, you know? Ah, no, but see, Kai Boom's ice cold. But Kai Boom, okay, we're going to do this anyway. Kai Boom coming for Merrifield. Martin coming for Reynolds. Then we're going to go Kendall leads off, followed by Tucker, uh, followed by Gray, and then then we're going to do Martin, Blade, Hayes, or Martin, Blade, Barnes, Hayes, Keyboom. All right, there we go. Let's see. We got Keller on the bump. Oh, there we go. Just getting right to it there. Oh, geez. A bunt that rolls the whole way to uh, first base and just let him on. Interesting. Interesting play there. We just got right to it there, didn't we? Oh, great way to start the game. Love this. Love this. Every year it seems like this happens. It's just, you know, you get to the end, you're trying to win 90 games, and it's just like roadblock, roadblock, roadblock. It's like they, they it's like you always get the August injuries. You always get the September injury. Like what what was that? Like what the like what the hell is that play? You get the September injuries, you get the August injuries. And then when you play games like this, you get shit like that that happens. So, you know, it's just it, – and I under, I mean, I don't know what difficulty – I just – I don't know. I can't remember what difficulty I'm playing it on, but obviously it's not freaking rookie. Um, great, great. This just makes me want to slam my keyboard and uh, just sim this till we win. Uh, yeah. If, uh, if they score another run, I'm just going to – this will be the, the shortest game you guys ever watch me play. They score another run before we get an out. I mean, I already want to break my keyboard over my uh, over my knee. I mean, it's like, does anyone? Does anyone actually? And I think I say this every year too. Does anyone actually want to win? It seems like in our simulation here, it's just like, oh, we'll clinch it when we clinch it. Like, whatever. We're. Be it's like they don't want to go out and win the division. They're just like, you know what, whatever. Brewers are going to lose eventually. We'll clinch it then. Like, who cares? You know? Way to go, Kendall. Cole Tucker. Well, we got four runs to make up, so you're in a effing hole right now Keller wow 
Jason Watt just roped that to right field. Bladé. Mm, bummer. Nice contact, though. I just feel like in all these videos we have, I've just been so angry. Nothing's going... Uh, well, I shouldn't say that. I was like, I feel like nothing's going right. That's not true. We're obviously about to clinch the playoffs, but, I mean, in these games we're playing, I feel like nothing's going right. What's Keller at? 60 pitches already? 43. <laughs> Pirates reverting to their old one hit. Th this is exactly what happened right in time for playoffs. Walking into the playoffs, the Buckos couldn't get a hit. Not even score a run. Couldn't get a hit to save their lives. It looks like we're right along that same trajectory. So we'll walk in right to the Braves. With a um, with a nice, you know, three hits and twenty-seven innings, or some BS like that. Mitch Keller, swing and a miss. Who didn't see that one coming? Kendall up to bat. Just looking. Cole Tucker. Uh, okay, it's getting to the wall. That's a double. There you go. Chip away. That's all you can do. Tristan Gray, is he going to walk? There you go. Now we're in business. Jason Martin. That's going to get down. Mm, got to go. Got to send that one there. Tucker, you're fast. You got to go. Okay, Bladé. Hey, hey, Bladé. That's why we traded for Kepler. There you go. That's a nice little walk there. A little walkie walk. Hayes could come through huge here. Yep, huge for the Brewers, all right. Ice cold. Three players in our starting lineup, ice cold. Unbelievable. Not all that surprised, though. It's the playoff time. Can't be all that surprised. Wouldn't it be right if we ended on a hot streak? On a hot streak and a healthy streak. Wouldn't be wouldn't it be normal. Color gonna make it through, you know, four innings. Hey, he did. Yeah, we'll hit Keller one more time. Oh, okay, it was a smart decision. I shouldn't say smart. It was a lucky as hell decision. Is he going three? No, I thought he was. I thought he was trying to get three there for a second. Keller, way to help yourself out. Kendall. Doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. Keller, you tried. Well, I mean, you'd have enough runs if you didn't implode in the first inning there, Keller. It's really, I mean, it's really hard for your team to come back from a 4 nothing deficit at the top of the first and win the game. It's really hard to do that. 
So you come out, you spend all day getting ready for the game. Players get up at you know ten o'clock. They get they do their stretches. They have a whole morning routine. They get to the field like one o'clock for seven o'clock game. They're going through all this. They're hitting a tee. They're taking batting practice. They're you know warming up, throwing long, throwing a long toss, everything. They're going through this for six, seven hours, just to within the first twenty minutes of the game, be down four nothing. I'm surprised any team comes back from that. I'd be so devastated if I if I did all that stuff. If I did all that over the course of the day, and my pitcher throws freaking just potatoes for the first inning and gets us down by four or five runs. It's just like, come on, dude, really? I mean, obviously that's not the case. I'm just being dramatic here. As competitors, as we are competitors, we are trying to come back. And you just think of it as a zero-zero game at that point. I don't like the fact that Keller has, what, one strikeout so far? Yeah, one strikeout? Like, what the hell? Two strikeouts. <laughs> Just this little diddly BS. Kiboom just got caught looking. Well, I think it's a miracle here that... Um, oh, Kevin Newman. There you are. There you went. Take a seat. Um, Kevin Newman playing for the Brewers there. I think it's going to be a miracle if uh, Keller gets through seven innings. Like a legitimate miracle based on how he started the game. All right, this is the Pirates' chance. Nine more outs to go. Oh, crap. Didn't mean to hit Keller. It's my fault. Dang. Yep, it's on me. That's on me. Too happy with the space bar. Kendall, there you go. That's a double at least. He's been hustling today. Tucker pass ball all right almost anything scores him here there you go chipping away all right Tristan Gray again all the dude does is hit and play great defense Jason Martin. Ooh, 3 1. You got to let that go, man. Could um could Mitch Keller get actually through eight innings? Is that possible here? Maybe the worst eight inning game I've ever seen in my life. Eight innings, four runs in the first, five hits, bizarre three strikeouts and four walks. Like, what? There you go. Oh, crap. I meant to sit, I meant to sit our guy down. Lede. Nope. Dang. Barnes. -y. Let's go, Hayes. I was inside, man. Let it take it. Take that pitch. K 
Can you get through all? Can you get through all nine innings? Is that possible? Nope. Okay, he's done. You're done, Mitch. You're done. De La Garza. The other new toy we're gonna have eventually here. That's a great way to start. He's supposed to be closer than Kelly too, to the majors. Yes, Yale Puig. Still in the game. Let's get a little double play action here, huh? Or whose fault is that? Don't know if that was a pass ball or what. What? Wild pitch. Okay. So we know we have at least one wild pitch. Oh, just made it harder for ourselves again. Okay. Key boom, you're up. Boom, get in there. Take a couple hacks. Man, I was expecting to have this video celebrate with a big win. If not in the first game, in the second game. Completely accidentally left him at the to bat. But it does not look like that's going to happen here. All right. Bummer. Let's just get out of this game here. Guys, all we need is one. We need one win. One win or a Milwaukee loss. Let's just sim this game. Just get it over with. <laughs> Unreal. There we go. Hey! Hey! Tristan Gray, player of the game. What do you do? Three for four. Guy just rakes. All he does is rake. Love it. Singer got the win. <sighs> Again, much, much harder than it has to be. I think we have an opportunity to win. I'm not sure how many. Yeah, I don't know if we actually do have an opportunity to win 90 games this year. We'll finish her out. We'll take her to the end of the season here. So, guys, three out of four years. There you go. Can we get some people hot? Or at least can we get them not ice cold for the playoffs here? Most pitching wins, Brennan McKay. There we go. 18 and 5. Chris Stratton day to day. Someone else hurt. Honeywell out four months. Uh, the old end of season. Uh, Brian Reynolds just battling an unknown injury forever. So let's take a look at the final season standings here. Playoff coverage. Well, let's look at the standings first. 80 plus 81 run differential. Wow. Dodgers, look at that. 112 and 50 plus 359 run differential. Um, but I feel confident. We can hang with any of these teams. I really do believe that. Um, let's see what the playoff tree is like. Braves, again. Let's go. I'm excited by this. I'm not shying away from this one because I fully believe we can beat this team. 100% believe we can beat this team. Ooh, I love it, baby. I love it. 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 This is what we play for. Yeah, see, it hurts that Reynolds is quadricep strain. That hurts. That hurts us big time, not going to lie. Um, are we missing? I think I feel like we're missing someone here. 
Kings with pitchers. Coar. Oh, he did not have a good stint. Four Ks, eight walks. Yikes. Are we missing someone? I guess not. Thought we were there. Huh, no worries. Okay, so guys, if you look, we've you know we should pause and uh, congratulate ourselves here on uh, a little bit of an accomplishment. Um. Well, okay, that kind of makes it seem it kind of bums me out, but um. Look, ninety wins, first place in the division. First place in the division, finished with the same exact record as last year. First place in the division. Um, got much better on offense. Uh, I mean, then about the same, you know, about the same in terms of worse on on uh, def or pitching and defense. But, um, yeah, so far, lost division series 3-0, lost division series 3-0. That is absolutely going to change this year because we're going to beat, I mean, Soroka and DeGrom, that's that's a tough one too, but um, we're gonna do it. We are uh, we're gonna beat this this uh, this Braves team. I'm tired of them sweeping us in the playoffs, so I'm excited. We're gonna come back. We're gonna have the uh, divisional game one, divisional game two, and divisional game three, and then after we sweep them, we're gonna move on to the next one. But uh, anyways, guys, have a great one. Thanks for joining us. We are back to back NL Central.